Hey angels, welcome back. So today we're going to talk about um, the time when I was a senior in high school. Yes, it was my last year of high school and I was skipping one of my classes every day. I was being a bad child. And um, to me, I felt it wasn't for no reason. It was for a good reason. But um, I wasn't too bad because at least I did tell my mother, you know, what was going on. And she understood. So what happened was, like I said, I was in 12th grade. I had um, four classes to go to, four periods, okay? First period was fine. Second period was fine. Third period was fine. But fourth period was hell. And it was hell because this was a math class. I think it was something like Algebra 2. Something like that. Something like that. You know, Algebra or Geometry. Something like that. But anyways... The teacher. I could not stand the teacher. This woman was rude. She was mean. And she was not teaching me anything. I wasn't learning anything new in this class. Okay? And also, the students was very annoying. Okay? Nobody in that class I was friends with. Everybody in that class basically annoyed me for some reason. So you have the rude ass, mean teacher, and then you have the annoying ass students in the class, okay? And the fact that I wasn't learning anything new. So with all of that in one, I couldn't take it. Okay, I did not need that class to graduate in the first place. And I went to my counselor, okay? One day I went down to my counselor and talked to my counselor. And I made sure that I didn't need that class to graduate. Because I didn't want to fail, you know, if I made the choice to stop coming to this class, I didn't want to fail. So I went to the counselor and I asked if I really needed that class and she told me okay no you do not need this class to graduate that's all I needed to know I spent like two weeks in this class and I was annoyed so annoyed annoyed as hell didn't like the teacher she was getting on my nerves so I was like it's time for me to go two weeks is too long to be sitting in a class that I'm not enjoying two weeks is too long to be any place that I'm not enjoying okay so um, I made up in my mind, I was like, I'm going to start coming to this class. It was my fourth um, class of the day, my last class before I go home. So somehow I was going to, you know, skip this class. I was going to stop coming. The thing about that, I was like, okay, so where am I going to go though? Because I didn't have a car at the time. And um, even though my mother knew that I didn't want to come to this class it wasn't like she was gonna come pick me up every day so I made up in my mind I was like I'm gonna leave this class and I'll just figure out as time goes by where am I gonna go so the first day <clears throat> the first day I decided to leave this class I went and sit up in the bathroom okay for that first day I stood up in the bathroom and probably like a day or two after that I was called to the office and they wanted to know oh so this day you was at school this day you were at first period second period third period but here shows that you didn't show up um to fourth period what happened here I was like okay so I didn't show up be well I was there no, what did I say? I said, um, what did I tell them? Okay, yeah, I told them, I said, 
um, that day my mother came and picked me up early after third period and I just forgot to sign out that's what happened and they was like oh okay well just remember anytime you get picked up early to sign out and I was like okay I will I don't know after that day I was just like I'm still not gonna go back to that class no matter what um I just said a prayer and I said God please don't let them ever um, call me to the office again or nothing happened but I just can't do this I'm not going back to this annoying ass class I just can't do it so thankfully after that day I skipped every day still out of that class and I never got called back to the office I was lucky that time God was on my side God was definitely on my side because he knew I just couldn't take sitting up in this class every day with this annoying woman you know I didn't want to tell her off or anything like that I didn't want to go berserk so I just had to get away from this class so God was on my side he heard my prayer so I was not called to the office anymore after that but every day after that I just skipped the class and I just roamed around the um the school during that time I was just roaming around school doing whatever I wanted and I just never got caught so um at the end of the school year when my report card came it did had me for that class every day it did they marked like it was like 30 something days that I was missing on my report card from that one class I was you know I was present in all three other classes but that one last class I was marked absent you know and nobody said anything about it <laughs> and I just had to laugh to myself about that and I showed my mother my report card we was talking about it and everything and like I said she understood me so everything was okay you know and I graduated and everything was fine so that was the time guys when I was just a bad kid and I started skipping that class because it was so annoying to me and I could not sit in that class a day over the two weeks that I made it in there it was just too much for me so I made that decision I went along with it um luckily I didn't get caught or anything and everything went well so um thank you so much guys um I hope you enjoyed this story time there's many many more to come so don't forget to subscribe like share and comment thank you so much angels see you next time